guys, Tyler here, and it is early in the morning, and this camera is not going to be up. No, it's not. What's up, guys? It's Tyler here. Today, guys, I froze another every night. It is crack, yes. Hey, the one with the one we had froze, cracked open. This has nothing to do. You see the side? Solid. It's hard. It's solid like a rock. And right here, I got some warm water. In this bowl. And supposedly, if you freeze an egg for a whole day, I just did it overnight and it's solid. Yeah, and I'm putting it in water, more water, and see, supposedly, it's supposed to be very easily to peel the, the shell off. I'm going to put it in more water. So, supposedly, you can peel off. So I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna like, sit there for a minute and yeah. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. This is just gonna be a little quick video here and yeah. yeah let's hope it works. It really does. I watched someone else doing it work. So let's see it work. Maybe I should do it for all day. It's all good stuff. you saw there was a whole crack right there. It really just it refixed itself on it. Come on, let me think. Let me oh my gosh, man. So it is true. It actually works. <coughs> so if you just leave it in there for a minute, okay. For a little bit. This isn't even an egg, it's a frozen egg. Now it came off so easy, guys. I don't want to overflow it. Um, overflow it. Like, I, I've overflowed it. Clean it with water. If you look at it in the water, if I wash my hands, I'll grab the camera. Hold on. Put it in the water. And if you look, you see an outside of the egg. If you look at it, like, let's look. Let's see. There. You can see an outline of the egg. I don't know if you guys can. Oh, it's so hard to do this upside down. Okay, see the egg? Yeah, I, if you can, you can see a little outline. I'm going to put a, a little arrow to it right there if you can see it. All right, guys. So that's the egg, and that's weird. What happens if I cook it now? I really want to crack it and cook it and see what it does. But it's like the yolk is still in there. I don't hear it. So when I froze this egg, I decided I'd like spin it. So I spun it to see. Because if you spin an egg, so you can tell if there's a yolk or not in it. So like if it's hard boiled and you spin it, it should be easy, really easy to spin. If it's not hard boiled and there's still a yolk in it, it should be all wobbly or something, I think, if, I, if that's how it goes. But that's how you know. So, there's this, guys. <laughs> it does work, though. So, if you need an egg hack for content or something, if you do YouTube, I'm just going to do this so you can see me. Then, don't forget, freeze an egg overnight or for a whole day in the freezer or whatever you use to freeze an egg. Put it in warm water, let it sit there, and then start taking the stuff off. You get this. For science. I saw a YouTuber do it. I decided, science. Yes. I'll be right back. And guys, hold on. And I do that because of glass, and I don't like that. So, guys, just. A little quick video, and I'm going to see you guys later. Like, oh my gosh, peanut. Like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Goodbye. I'll see you later. Peanut.